I try to let them hang up now, so I yeah. don't accidentally hang up early as frack. Like you did, like you did with uh, uh, I. D- you didn't. It was an accident. No, nothing happened. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to say oh, shout out to Jasher, who's been here the whole time. You're such a great dude. I'm gonna see if Faz just just Faz didn't hit the update. Let's go. All right, Kayla, get ready. There Hello. we go. Oh, I'm here. They have a cuter setup. <laughs> you guys see me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We see you. your setup's better. It's fine. No, it's awesome. <laughs> Dude, it's like her setup's oh, better. It's fine. <laughs> no, I. My lighting is so bad because this is a giant window. So uh, it's, it's okay. Just, I know you can't I see it, but we're right next to them too. <laughs> Hell yeah, it looks good. The plants. The little plants are okay. Epic. Joe, shout out to plant plant gang. <laughs> Joe has like eight plants that he like oh, found in the plants? garbage. Yeah, yeah. He found plants in the garbage and was like, "I'm raising them." <laughs> uh, Nick actually oh just bought God. new plants and are vowing to not kill them. So oh, that, that's what we're hoping for. <laughs> oh yeah, or... Shannon just mentioned the squishmallow you got. Hell yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. I don't think it's actually a squishmallow, <gasps> but my sister gave this to me. Ava. Yes, and it's, <laughs> I love it so much. It's very cute. So he just sits there. I didn't mean to touch your thigh. That's okay. He meant to. I mean, I can if you want. Please don't. <laughs> <laughs> Someone's screen name is Dirty Sanchez. Uh, did you want to start a lobby? <laughs> Do you want to describe what a Dirty Sanchez is? I'm going to leave that up to you guys. <laughs> I'm, uh, I, me and Nate were just staring each other down. Poop like... mustache. Oh, I can't see you guys anymore. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're on, we're on the stream. Uh... <laughs> uh what do you what do you want to be explained as? Cause you are your own person. Oh, uh. Cause like I, th- well, I think I put uh I'm I think Kayla. I put yeah <laughs> I put like gamer and artist, but you're skater, mother, esthetician, and more. <laughs> pretty much all the above. Oh so, yeah, epic. I'm I'm Kayla. I I'm pretty pretty epic. <laughs> no, I'm a. <laughs> I thought you'd be like <laughs> esthetician slash skateboarder slash artist slash gamer slash mom. Oh my god. <laughs> I thought you were gonna be like, I'm pretty, and then just leave it at that. I was like, alright. <laughs> and then just leave the stream. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Bye. <laughs> I lowered my settings a little bit, so it's going to look a little bit worse. But I optimized the stream for video call, not gaming. So we're going to roll with it, y'all. <laughs> I, I Like, listen, man, I'll be happy if it just makes it 15 more minutes into that. Yeah, we're at 747 out of 8 hours. It could be a little over 8 hours for the cooking commercial. And let me say, that steak is brown. <laughs> we'll take a breather real quick. I'm going to take a deep breath, drink some water, and then we'll assess the game. <laughs> so we get, like... Because I'm sort of getting yeah. like the last call, like jitters over. Because it's like we've we're not done yet, but we've made it. We've made it past the hardest part to the stream, which was starting. You're it. Almost there. Mm-hmm. Then I finished the stream with who was in Paris, and then we just... yeah, you're right. We'll have Eddie answer it. Uh, no, nah, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> Eddie wouldn't do that. It just no, just a bit because he played a meme earlier that it was Homer Simpson rapping AI. So you can take that as you will. <laughs> yeah, that was we didn't expect that. We immediately were like, ah! all right, real all quick right. in chat. Uh, how long? Is the season of the curse fundraiser link working for it's going to be working for another month yeah until um, i think the day after my birthday maybe yeah, the day 15th. after your birthday um it's going to be going for another month after that i'm still going to be like trying to throw out some tiktoks and we're going to cut up some stuff to uh advertise for it but we're just going to go until whenever at this point we're almost at the end of the arby's commercial here yes oh who said that by the way jay sure okay okay cool the the the, the legend jay sure kayla cab young world <laughs> kayla's aesthetics what's her name kayla aesthetics, kayla's aesthetics. <laughs> Dude, that commercial that I made for you was pretty sick. <laughs> it's awesome. Did, was there a commercial? Yeah. Uh, she, she was trying to think of a new name, and I thought of a new name and like designed a whole little ad for it and voiced it and stuff with that. We just hit eight hours and five minutes on stream, so. Yeah, so we are. We're, we're neck and neck. Yeah, we're basically <laughs> at the finish line here. Uh, should we do tarot cards or just. Wait, wait, you hear that? Yeah, we. Don't give us a sign. Season of the Cursed. Oh my god, he's Fun. gonna donate to Season of the Cursed, too. Oh no. <laughs> That's a clip. Yeah, I love just doing the <laughs> switch just to pog. <laughs> oh no. Listen to Puzzle Fest. Ooh, no fingies. Okay, okay, we are officially at. Within the last minute of that. We are that. within the last minute of the eight hour uh, Arby's Smokehouse commercial Com- Season of the Curse 2 Funders and live stream. <laughs> uh, I will, I, when we get down to 10 seconds, I will be. Give us a countdown. All right, seven, 
four, three, two, one. Eight hour commercial. I don't know when it ends, but we've hit the eight hours. That's what's on the DVD cover. Yeah. So. It might be like eight hours in a couple minutes or something. Or they pull it out of the oven or something. We finished the eight hour smokehouse. Oh, your arm is in the shot. <laughs> We're done with that. Does that count? We are still, go. He's still playing Phasmophobia. Okay. I'm sorry. You're, I'm still hosting the stream, too. You do your stream. <laughs> yeah, we got two streams going on. This is the Season of the Curse soundtrack on... Uh, oh, God, I need the other one. Shop.com. If you want to grab it, we're doing a sequel. Oh, we got no, no, no. a lot of uh, work to do on it. Oh, he's taking it out. What? He's taking oh, it out. I pulled the brisket out. He's taking it Let's out. Let's go. You guys can't I'm see it on, on the big stream, but he do be pulling it out. He has pulled the meat out, and his, it is steaming. His pull out And now it is faded to black to the PlayStation Home menu. That's fun. Which we we will still be talking about Socket too, but still. Yeah, we can also talk more about Kayla and whatever you want yeah, to talk I was... about too, because we definitely did that with everybody. Uh, yeah, like your channel, the Minecraft stuff you've been doing with uh, me and Clover and everybody was very, very fun. I've liked that. Same with like the Faz and Fortnite shit too. Oh yes, you're so, good. The Jay, Faz sure. is definitely the big one. Scary. <laughs> it's that... definitely throw. Oh, that was me oh. throwing salt. <gasps> it threw. Th <gasps> Mute. DJ, we're literally gonna die. I know we're hosting a stream, but we're literally gonna die. In phasmophobia, I'm just gonna. Okay? I'm just gonna say, Jaser, it's okay. It's okay. Like, you can. Uh, I know. It, it's fun. We're hiding in the locker. We're also gonna talk in stream. We're not gonna whisper like that for now. <laughs> but you were hiding in the locker. You didn't want me to. Well, say what you had to say. Okay. <laughs> it's okay, Jaser. The eight-hour commercial is over, but we are still going strong with the Arby's. It's a live stream event. <laughs> DJ scared out of his mind pointing at the screen. Oh yeah, because he muted us, and I was like, the people are in the people I know. Are in the They're watching. They have eyes. <laughs> Unless they don't, then I'm sorry. But either then they wouldn't. I won't continue that, but you get what I was going to say. Yeah, Not in a rude way. We just. There's spots where we can't talk. <laughs> I know, but I was just like, like, Nate's like, but we'll die. I'm like, but people are talking to us. I get that. It'll be there. <laughs> people never talk to us. What are you okay, doing? Okay, you're so right. <laughs> this is the most people I've talked to in like a year and one day <laughs> that I actually knew who I was going into the call at least. <laughs> also me trying to plug our stream while you're hiding yeah, in the locker. Yeah, <laughs> just whispering. I'm like, listen, <laughs> you gotta donate to Season of the Curse too. And then you're like, shut, we're gonna die. We're gonna die. You can't mute. We're on stream. I'm like, we're gonna literally die. <laughs> like the ghost can take my body. It's kind of like when we filmed the first season of The Curse and we were in the basement and it was all dark. And, and you're like, and then my cat shape shifted. It was scary. And you were legitimately scared. You're like, there's something over there. I was like, I don't care. I want to. I want to finish. I want to go home. I want to go home. <laughs> I don't care if there's a ghost over there. I want to go home. I am so tired right now. And you're yeah. telling, you're seeing things in the corner, and I want to go home. <laughs> To rein it back in so that Kayla's not, like, just sitting over here. <laughs> Listen to us babble on. Um, babble on. <gasps> that's a good Suicide Boys song. There's also a movie. <laughs> Movies! Who makes those? Get them out of here. I know that you and Nate play a lot on his channel and stuff, but I don't really know much about, like, you as a person or anything that you've done or what you like, except for what Nate has told me. Like the basics, like yeah, skating, art, yeah. gaming, and... What was the thing that you... That was uh, art that they... Yeah, made? that's how Kayla and I became friends other than like through her dad's Instagram. That was... Your art yeah. was being for sale at the time when we were both 16. And I was like, oh, hell yeah, dude. I've got to get the cab dragon of Kayla's. And then we then Neither of us had done an online transaction. We both made PayPal accounts. And first we did. <laughs> how to ship something. We both made PayPal accounts at the same time to get it. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to send you this money through here. And like, I got it. And I'm like, okay, and then here's my address. I think this is how you back it. <laughs> and like... Yeah. When I moved back home, you're like, I see you posted something about Minecraft. We should totally play sometime. I have a server and it's modded. And I'm like, dude, like, 
You're like lucky blocks, I think. And I'm like, dude, let's fucking go. Yeah, I was in a whole lucky block stage for a while. Dude, lucky blocks is so fun. I wish we we should do more of that at some point too. Or add that into the series you've been doing. Oh my god, it would destroy everything. <laughs> yeah, right. You'd Everyone to, would like, just be TP. opening lucky blocks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. Just like teleporting. Someone's like, who, who the fuck teleported? All right, who TP'd and opened up a big ass lucky block? Cause the server ain't running right. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Oh my god. World, world edit? <laughs> yes. Oh god, yeah. Hold on, I'm a world edit real quick. Joe. Joe is so bad with that too. He's like 5,000 by 5,000. Oh, I'm at 500. <laughs> oh god. I know I try not to do too much on the server. And then poor Clover. Yeah. She always crashes. I'm like, sorry. <laughs> when we were recording Puzzle Valley, and then you were first recording out over your phone, and then there's one where Joe was sitting in the corner eating chips into the microphone while I was... Re- he would put a Dorito in his mouth and go right up to my microphone, and then just... <laughs> just slow crunch. Oh, my God. Then he put a like, glass dome over it. <laughs> yeah, I'll just see you eating, like, uh, white cheddar cheese its or popcorn, just... <laughs> Like, it's so funny. I'm like, who got the munchies? I'd rather have someone with uh, popcorn because it is the quietest of the yeah. snacks. Thing like is it though? <laughs> it depends on, it depends uh, on the kind, but it does crumble very fast. If more jo- than like, yeah. longer. And- if Joe walked up to me with a bag of Cheetos and a bag of popcorn, he's like, which one do you want me to eat? I'm going to be like, the popcorn, please. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> that was a bad impression of you, Joe. That's not how you sound, so. What's the cringe emoji for, Joe? Tell me now. <laughs> for the whole stream. <laughs> yeah, the whole eight-hour stream that we just that's did. That's just fair. Yeah. <laughs> I, oh, yeah, Joe isn't here. Oh, Hi, he's Joe! Been, he's been here the whole time, which I'm just like... like Shout out to Joe and Jay Sher and Tim and everybody who's been like here for a long time. Yeah, people were in before their call, they had their call, and then they stayed after, and that's been very cool. Yeah. And you posted about it for uh-huh. sure, and Grim posted about it. I know a couple other people probably posted about yeah. it, and I appreciate that. That's super cool. Super grateful to everybody who's... Uh, Made it out. Made it out tonight to Bar yeah. Drive. I'm, I'm, I appreciate everyone who ever been been making out tonight. I just I wish Wait, I could get there. <laughs> I wish I could get there someday. We're, we're praying. Uh, <laughs> I don't know why I slipped into the it's southern. It's been hours. <laughs> I know, dude. The thing is, usually me and Nate would just sleep over and just make a time. We're just so drained that we're probably going to go. Probably, probably. going to clean up all of our shit after we end stream. Yeah. And then just like sit and then part ways so that we don't bug each other <laughs> oh my god eight hours is a long time yeah well, especially to like so stay entertaining like recording like a lot of our blocks will be like that video. like i mean you've recorded a lot where we're just playing games most times it does it does just be like hanging out and playing games and stuff but like being being on screen like that is so draining because like if we're doing a regular oh, yeah. session of recording irl it's usually 15 episodes in about eight hours it's like a work day like pretty mm. straight up and it's crazy usually yeah. after episode 15 about eight hours in is when it gets goofy we are right about at the sanity point like we've got the last of it held together you remember the <laughs> night i was tired <laughs> like two in the morning on minecraft with a whale and shit yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh my god i know i'm like nate's was, like, getting weird like, I'm <laughs> sleepy <laughs> <laughs> and he goes like, yeah, Nate needs to go to bed. <laughs> it's two in the morning for him. I have that. I think I clipped oh that God. one. Oh, yeah. that's good. The day we were supposed to record the like finale of Puzzle Valley and Dwight bailed. And oh, yeah, I yeah. say bailed, he got some stuff. Just and last minute he came. Yeah, and then we yeah. played Minecraft. We recorded it, but I was so fucking yeah, it was pissed. was me and Adrian. That's I was right. so mad that I was just like doing random shit in Minecraft. Then you prank called your grandma about cake pops oh, yeah, in the I same did. house. I did. I that did. was so <laughs> funny. He's just like, hey, grandma, what's for dinner? Oh, this. Oh, you got any uh, Starbucks Hick Pop? <laughs> <laughs> what? Starbucks Hick Pop. <laughs> I love that because I was like, Grandma, do you think that the earth is flat? Cause it... <laughs> and she was like, yeah, do you think it's round? I was trying to like mess with my grandmother. I was like, yeah, I've been watching a lot of YouTube videos. I think you might be right. And <laughs> I was so pissed at the time. But oh God. I think that's where the sanity is right now, where we are. It might have been the challenge mode. I don't know, oh, but I yeah. had not seen it. And then all of a sudden, <laughs> Zach was like, we have that little hand again. And then Clover just started screaming. Oh She's like, God. oh, my fucking ball. <laughs> Did, does it work well for the wish functions? I've wanted to try that out where it's like, I want to be back alive or whatever like that. Like, I want to escape and it unlocks the house. And, like, I wish for resurrection. And if someone died and you're next to it and you call that, they'll come back to life. Like, so cool. When you make a wish, it gives you, obviously, the wish. But then it gives you kind of, like, a con to it, too. So, yeah, yeah. Because that's how the original, like, the actual monkey's paw is. You actually would probably be able to 
to explain more about what that was because I remember I was trying to explain it to like you and Clover because Clover's like, wait, that's a thing, and I'm like, yes, yeah, that's <laughs> like, a real thing. and that's Jordan Peele's uh, production company, Monkey Paw Production. Yeah, no, I'm not joking. That don't fucking. That's not what I mean, but. Well, I I know, but like I know what a monkey paw like is. Like the story of the monkey's paw, I mean. Yeah, because like, the whole thing is it's a wishing thing where if you like peel back one finger on it, that's one wish. But that means that it's gonna it's yeah. gonna backfire, and you have a certain amount of wishes, and each one's gonna back. It's like the yeah. uh, what is it called? Urban legend of being a lawyer, <laughs> just the loophole, the the cursed object. Well, it's the same thing with genies too. Because <laughs> yeah, if you exactly. like, hey, can I have a big dick? And it's like a big was, guy named Dick that yeah, just exactly. kills you, and it's like. Yeah, so like, or a big truck named Dick crashes into them. <laughs> yeah, like, like that's specific. literally the premise of Monkey's Paw. Yeah, yeah. yeah Jay, Jay, sure. Thank you. Like I am, all I know is movies, and all I know is references to movies. So yeah, Mine's I appreciate. Music. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He's the music guy. I'm the movie guy. <laughs> and, and YouTube. Yeah. Or memes, dude. Kayla is also a pretty good meme lord. I should have added meme lord to that. I'm sorry. <laughs> meme lord. <laughs> Yeah, like the classic memes. Oh uh, like I'll God. be saying dumb shit, and you'll be like, "Yeah," and I'm like, "Vine days," and you're like, "Hell yeah!" <laughs> See, I hype you up. Yeah, I know. I know all the vines. <laughs> For anyone in the stream who hasn't listened to Puzzle Valley, I'm Dean. I'm sorry. Nate plays a character <laughs> named Dean, and his whole shtick is that he's the memer and he's the, the class clown, the class clown meme lord. But it's to a point where he'll just say random shit in the middle of an episode and people have like pointed out to me where they're like what is that reference and it's it's so funny when you do something because immediately you'll say something and you're like yeah that's a deep cut if you know what that means <laughs> you appreciate that and it's every like you sorry motherfucker i still don't know what that is but you every time you're like you sorry mother you if you know that video, sorry motherfucker cut. yeah it's a it's a good deep cut yeah, I've traumatized you from going Fortnite all the time. During that, that way before I played Fortnite. And now that we play Fortnite, because Kayla's like, please download Fortnite. It's so much fun. I'm like, eh, okay. And then it is a lot of fun. Uh, See, but... Jay Sure's listen to, listen to Puzzle, but I never get those references. You know what, Jay Sure? Neither do I. I don't get those references. Skill issue is all I can say. Because he'll just go, like, put some more. <laughs> go go put, put some, some more. more. Put some more. Go put some more. Or Starbucks Cape Pop. Like, some of them are modern. Oh some of them God. are semi-modern. And some of them are just obscure and old as fuck <laughs> or just inside like old family jokes that are like from before my time even like shit from 1980 something like, yeah from my dad <laughs> there is a bitch <laughs> um my dad's little album that him and my mom did with a tape recorder and acoustic guitar and a microphone what year uh, was that 1980 something but uh my dad was like 19 so yeah $19 I... fortnite card who wants it <laughs> I didn't want to bring it up, but I did. I was going to ask, but I assumed he didn't want to, if your dad was going to do that live performance. Oh, he but, wasn't, like, not down for it, but just he didn't practice or anything. Yeah, that's, that's fine. Just, like, we could do, like, done it. we should just do a music video for it. That would be funny. Yeah. Or fun. Both. Yeah. Nate, for, Nate, for your dad? Yeah, yeah, my dad. He's a musician? Uh, it's sort of like how I am, like, where you, he can play harmonica really well, and he can play guitar, like, mainly just, like, playing stuff that, like, sounds good, and he used to do, like... Uh, he would just play like, the guitar and then like sing or make a song up over it as he's doing it or like a cover sort of song. Oh, like, that's cool. But on actually on the wall right over there, I don't know if you have stream up, but it's this old holographic sticker on this tape that my dad recorded with uh, like a tape deck and a microphone. Uh, I would think it was my mom holding oh, the wow. microphone up to like him and the guitar back in. He was 19. He was born in 68. So he was like it was like what 1987, 1988. They, they, he just did like 10 or so songs and a couple years ago maybe 2021 when i moved back home i finally you had a nice new tape convert or tape player and i converted it digitally and like removed the static from it and put it up uh, unlisted on my channel it's 1980x for buy two old shoes my dad i mean see, see jay she was like you, you guys actually need to make a music video we do he actually fun fact season of the cursed he uh did the the backing track for uh venture venture yeah the guitar the little mute playing is my dad playing the guitar on that i i want Cool. Yeah, yeah, I wanted to do something where you played your dad as a kid doing that. Like recording that. That'd be fun. I mean, yeah. even for the video, that'd be kind of cool. I think it would, too, and just him being in it would be awesome. Nate's parents are so They've always cool. been supportive and cool of everything. I, I genuinely love them so much. They have, like, treated me so well. Uh, I don't come from, like, a very good household i, I won't say i'm a very loving home i won't go into it but just them like uh accepting me with open arms has been like just very nice to have and you're you're like the fact that your parents went out and got arby's and brought it back because we didn't have time to go pick up arby's before yeah. the stream yeah that was uh cool. just awesome. yeah they both helped with uh season of the curse your dad with the music and your mom helped with like just anything yeah <laughs> yeah, yeah.
My mom had done a voice guest spot in Puzzle Valley, too. Oh, yeah. Okay, this is probably one we of my... We're going to have to do spoilers on it, but definitely. Yeah, I mean, if anyone hasn't listened to Puzzle Valley, this will probably one of my favorite parts was in Puzzle Valley, uh, Nate's character, Dean, has a mom character, and I usually, like, played her voice. But during one of the parts where she walked in there, I had, like, went up to it, his it mom. It was a very tense part of the, like, the, the campaign of playing through, and we were, we were hiding. And then my mom came into the spot in the story where we're hiding, but they did, she didn't know I was there. But she had an inkling that I was there, so she talks. And usually DJ would read that. But he reached out to my mom, like, not in a rude way, but behind my back, and was like, hey, can you send me video audio of you reading these lines? Kind of heartfelt, like, here's the situation, and I'll play it live for Nate and, like, in the thing so that he hears you doing it and i'm not going to tell him about it and she did it and it was very cool and i think i had you leave it in right i'm like oh, oh, it makes you, so much yeah you to told me you told me to leave it in and i didn't want to because you wanted me to cry was the thing i, I wanted want, you I want to your mom but you to were so cry. you were so <laughs> gung-ho about uh i was trying to figure out if it was my mom or not you were like oh who's that who's that instead of like being emotionally invested in this the... i was parallel thinking i was like my left brain was on like is this my mom and my right brain was like damn dude these words right now this is crazy <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah, no, JJ, that was actually that was that was his mom. It was just uh, such a. It's probably my one of my highlights of the whole story. By the way, if anybody doesn't know, and Kayla included, it's uh, Puzzle Valley is one of DJ's D and D campaigns, basically, where uh, you have more of an explanation on it. But uh, they do it mainly remotely through like Discord or whatever, and he writes these whole campaigns out that are very well fleshed out. And then uh, upon recording it, he basically makes it an audio movie with the sound effects and the the music and the atmosphere just with no visuals and it's this really cool campaign with me our friend adrian who did a lot of the artwork for season of the cursed and then dwight, dwight yeah who plays a set of twins <laughs> that's why <laughs> when it's you like said a high best... school murder mystery D D campaign yeah and... it's my favorite thing we both have it tattooed on our skin yeah. so I that still have yet to play D. it's it's fun <sighs> I think it's really fun. I play it a different way than most people do, but I it's really fun. I would have it highly recommend it. And that, that campaign itself is very different from regular D&D because yes. I've seen some other D&D and seen your some of your other stuff too, but yeah, mine is uh, like very story based and like other D&Ds it's like very detailed. Can I kill the bartender? It's like let, roll Yeah, like it. yours is like a callback that was 3 <laughs> seconds in episode 2 might come back in episode 17. Yeah. Very very important if you didn't It's like a fucking escape room but a podcast. And, yeah, exactly. It's high school <laughs> But you pick uh, up that boat. <laughs> I I said I would be willing to like like run another one, but just not recorded because th- the way I am as a person is I will put so much effort into it for no reason. You should uh, just full full like how I record this, just so you can't separate anything and you have to just like denoise it. I and know. Just edit it. I know. It's so much fucking easier and more fun it, for me to do that. Like you could separate it out better when everything's separate, but boy, is it a pain in the ass. Just label all your stuff out the best you can and test it and just. That's, fucking it would set have it. to be a complete. So Completely different story. Also, yeah. who I don't know who's in chat yelling at us. That's Clover. Oh, Cl- Clover's in chat. Oh shit, Gnag Gang. <laughs> My God, Gnag Gang. <laughs> Clover, you silly little fella. All right. Um, I, we didn't mean to take over that conversation. By the way, uh, it's just we keep forgetting that we're humans that need to let other humans talk. Oh, if you had anything right. else you want to say, but uh, yeah, I was worried about that too. Yeah, just <laughs> like well, like like we'd been saying, everybody well, else has had like shows and stuff coming up or other YouTube stuff. Which you do have YouTube stuff here and there, but you're very busy. I have. I'm currently working on that Minecraft series. It's just extremely draining. Yeah, no, like how like, you put all that work into that is like how he does like his podcast and shit with like the sound effects and the different little things and making sure it like flows like a nice story is like so cool. Yeah, it's like writing. I have like a book of each episode and what I want to happen in there because Clover actually made a really good point and was like, hey, uh, Clover and Brie actually was like, hey, you need to figure out a goal for each episode because what's happening is you're cutting them off at random times. And I was like, oh my God, that's that's true. There needs to be a beginning, a middle, and an end. Yeah. And there's no grab and there's no end. Yeah. So I'm... I took a break, so I have three episodes out. No, two, 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 two you were episodes on the third, out. But... Three, including the trailer. Yeah. But the third one, I'm trying to figure out how to get a beginning, middle, and an end with the footage mm-hmm. that I have. So I have about six episodes I could release. I yeah, just yeah. the editing 
part is the no, hard the part. editing's always a bitch. <laughs> yeah, and I do everything myself, so I'm like, I, I don't yep. know. Like, I have to feed my kid food. I have to go to work, and then I have to, to do YouTube, and oh, and it's then just, just existing some days is too much. Uh, when you got to do all that, yeah, uh, we get it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I don't want to lay in my room just and watch Netflix. <laughs> just de- being depressed, alone, or anxious, it'll kill any of that. I mean, that's the whole. Oh the, yeah. That's the whole like theme of this whole stream of just talking to content creators. It's a lot to do anything. So, oh yeah. yeah. Uh, Jay Sure said, uh, "Surely Eldritch Journey's one shot with Kayla." Uh, by the way, Jay Sure is uh, from Podzilla, who was on earlier. They have a podcast about Godzilla, Godzilla movies. movies and stuff. Oh no way! My yeah. dad, uh, oh, shit, growing up, right. he yeah. showed me all the Godzilla movies, Ultraman, uh, Planet of the Apes. Yeah, I know all those movies, all those old movies. Jay Sure's pretty cool, but <laughs> yo, what the heck? <laughs> but. <laughs> Uh, He's probably, like, hype as fuck. <laughs> if you ever listen to any, like, Godzilla stuff, if you like listening to podcasts, I would highly recommend Podzilla because he doesn't go into, like, cinematic detail on every movie, but he just talks about the good qualities of the movie. Oh, he said forget Caleb for Elder okay. Journeys. He said more like Caleb for Podzilla. Am I right? <laughs> Dude, that'd be so goaded. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, he does bring on guests all the time. That'd be cool. Yes. Could you tell me more about the Minecraft show? I, Minecraft. I think this is the first time I've heard about it. it. It's fairly new, the one that you did, the the one that we filmed like a month ago, and that you had put it out, the story one. Mine? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yours. Oh, I'm like, okay, wait, who are we talking about? Oh, <laughs> yeah, sorry. Yeah, so it took about four attempts to make this happen, because we've got like a group of five people and two of us are we just change our mind a lot so <laughs> we'd like start a world and then nate would be like all right we're we recording and i'd be like ah, i don't know if i'm ready yet and then clover would blow up the world so <laughs> then <laughs> we would start a new world and then everyone was like oh add this mod in add this mod in getting everybody set up for the mods it, it took a very long time to get to this point so i'm like very stoked that it's now it's on track course. and now we have like an end goal now we have a world we're playing on we've already filmed it's been released so it's it's definitely new for me to take this much time and editing into videos because normally i just make really stupid phasmophobia videos and occasionally fortnite yeah those are great (laughs) Um, though (laughs) they are and they'll always be my favorite like i'll never delete them i'll keep making them they might not get a lot of views but i honestly like them just to like watch myself it's a time capsule is what we always say it's fun to watch ourselves with our friends just doing something that we like enjoy I mean, yeah, it's memories. It's it's yeah, it's they're fun, it's they're fun times. Virtual memories. <laughs> I will not to like plug Puzzle Valley again, but that's exactly what Puzzle Valley is. Like yeah. the main theme of it is called it, like the thought theme song we have for it is not so long ago. Yep. Uh, every moment becomes not so long. Every ago. moment that passes is destined to become not so long ago, and I think that's the yeah. basis for why I make content is just to kind of hold these moments as yeah. close as I can, just so I can remember it. Yeah, that's kind of how how I feel. Yeah, the Minecraft, it's basically just a, a us. Uh, it's a modded Minecraft server. It's Java. Are you, are you pulling up the trailer? I uh, trying to, yeah, but I forgot how to spell your name because I'm sweating to death in here. It's like 90 in this room. You've been on stream room, for literally. eight hours. Dude, it's li- so in here anyway, it literally gets like 90 degrees with my monitors and shit. And there's two of us in here with a TV, oh. a PS4, two monitors, a soundboard. <laughs> it's <laughs> probably very hot in there right it now. It's very hot, yeah. Um, I can just go to my channel. You're pinned on my channel. It's called uh, uh, Minecraft. I don't okay, it's know. episode zero. Got you, got you. Episode zero. Yep. I All forget right. what my videos are called. Me too, dude. I do so many. I'm just like whatever. Okay. Yep. The trailer yep. is basically just a showcase of some of the mods that are in it, and then just us kind of building spawn. You're tiny. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh! <laughs> and again, this is World Games on YouTube. We will link Kayla's stuff. Uh, at the end of the stream in the description. The- <laughs> <laughs> Drop it. <laughs> okay. It's a uh, whirl. So the V is is like is whirlwind, like a- right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Like I, I, my gamer tag is Young World. That was a nickname given to me when I was a teenager. But <laughs> to be fancy with it, I did V's instead of U's. So sometimes people on games will be like Yoving Whirl, and I'll be like, no. <laughs> Every time I go to search it in my head or type it, I type I say Young Verl in my head just for fun, even though I know it's Whirl. <laughs> young Verl. Young Verl. Some people will be like, uh, Yavang Whirl. <laughs> I'm like, no. Yavang, Yavang, Yavoom. <laughs>
Uh, I just wanted to touch on the on the chat real quick. Shannon says that's what makes D and D fun. You can just not exist for a little bit. Yeah, that's genuinely. I'm talking about sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a, a non-commitment with death. But, yeah. but that's the thing about it. you can just play someone else and just forget about any any problems that you have and just be like think about someone else's yeah. problems that are just solved with an axe or a sword or whatever. Solved with your mind and what words you actually say in the roll of a dice versus yes, exactly. like money and time. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Unless it's in game I've money and time. I've been playing for a long time. I I have a board like the starter kit. <laughs> it's so Dude, stupid. I was just and then I have campaign. the dice. I was like, oh, I, I, I don't have anyone to play with. I would not mind, uh, dude, a campaign with like, well, like if you were in it and DMing it, that'd be wacky. But I could see it happening somehow. But I wouldn't mind doing it. But, but then I, Joe too, like yeah. just us three and Joe would be crazy. Oh, see, Jay, Jay, sure, I could make that happen for you. Biggest bucket list item play in one of my. Yeah, I would absolutely. That, I'm down. Jay, sure was cool. I think you guys should play a one shot. And the thing with DMing is, you just start it and you learn from it. Like every. Everyone's so nervous. It's a different form of hosting, is all. Yeah, honestly. it's literally just using it's... your imagination and like w- seeing if someone rolls a dice and like, ah, yeah, I think that happens. Yeah, mm-hmm. you just pretend and then you just figure it out from there. It's, yeah, it's really easy, unless you have. Well, okay, it's easier with because we had Dwight play when I uh, first started DMing, mm-hmm. and he was just very blunt with, "You need to do this. You need to do this. You're doing this." Tough love and. I appreciate the hell out of that uh, <laughs> because it really put me on a different track to understanding how to how to play. But D and D literally changed my life. I, I it's weird to say, but yeah, I think everyone should at least try it at least once. I, I would do it again. Just I think I was in a really wacky time, and it was admittedly a weird kind of D and D for me to get into, especially for how my brain works sometimes. Towards the end, once I seen how Eddie played, I got a lot better with it. Yeah, just there's so much shit that was happening in my life at the time, as well as everyone else. What we called it the trauma club yeah. about the cast of that because we all went through breakups and. And moves and everything else over the three years that we did the shit and right. just crazy yeah yeah literally just life played with a bunch of history majors that didn't want to commit well i mean that is also the biggest problem about D is just people who don't want to commit or can't commit people get busy and i get that but like you kind of know that going into it unless something absolutely comes up but yeah then... that's why one shots are good i do a yeah. one shot like immediately there is one shot i recorded with adrian and dwight and uh jay and fernanda oh shit i remember that like towards the end of it we had like an hour left and one of them was like i uh i actually have to go Uh, can we do this another day and we never we never finished it and jen's did art for it Uh, which was worse yeah not the art the fact that he made the art yeah didn't get to use it fully yeah it was uh called it was called capture of cottonmouth clyde it was very i don't even remember hearing the name i remember hearing that story but not the name of the campaign at all damn that's the only thing that sucks about D. otherwise i think i think it'd be very fun to get into even irl even you guys doing it by yourself would be a fun thing to even just be a part of find we should find one where the computer dms or something and do it through like online if that's a thing if i have to hear another thing about AI, I'm going to lose my mind. <laughs> well, we can call it, like, TV or something if it makes you feel better. No, it does <laughs> It's just, oh. uh, robots are taking over, robots are taking over. I don't like that machines are doing it now. I don't. I, I know really... a lich when I see one. <laughs> Sorry. That's not filthy oh, Frank, God. but... <laughs> What I do you think? Like Clover would play d and Yeah, I was thinking snake. Clover, too. Clover would be very fun to be on D&D. We would definitely have to come up with a plan to convince Zach for sure. But I know Clover I would Zach definitely be, do it in a heartbeat. I think Zach could be good at it too if he actually got into it for sure. But Clover would be like, oh, hell yeah, I'm oh, down. Because yeah. us are pretty good oh, at yeah. impro- improvising and ad-libbing for sure. And I think if Zach got into yeah. it, he would be as well. Because he says some right? funny shit sometimes. I'm like, where did you think of that? Come he is on. very quick-witted. He just, he's a little shy. I feel like we're polar opposites. I'm like that nerdy gamer girl, and he's like, Me. I drive a big white truck and ride my <laughs> MX bike, and he listens Shame. to hard rock, and I'm like listening yeah. to like weepy music. But anyways, <laughs> he like, I can get him into a nerdy thing like partially like i could tell he's yeah. like uncomfortable he's like oh, this is getting weird and i'm like Whoa! but you know yeah. like you can hear him I like, 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 like a seriously bit. like i was doing the kibble yeah. where i map like four times on fortnite and he's like you guys serious this shit sucks <laughs> yeah we were having fun he was like bye jay bye jay sure Sorry. i did want to say uh bye jay sure thank you so much for staying and like having that conversation with us and uh i cannot wait to show you guys season of the curse too whenever we get whenever we get anything with it we'll update more along yeah. with it this time so we get more hype for it because last time we told nobody we told anything no until it was halloween and it came out yeah we didn't promote <laughs> it after that because we felt like we 
like it wasn't good enough and then yeah but we we should wrap soon though because yep. we're getting tired but i appreciate you having you on kayla and you sharing it and everything i'm glad we got at least one round of faz and didn't have to update Bye. it uh i'm down to also right, live stream worried. games in the future too for sure like Fortnite and shit could be very wild you should definitely oh do, yeah definitely Fortnite. you guys should definitely do a D D one shot i would that would be fun i would love to see what you guys come up with yeah I I like not that I didn't try before, but I like fully try. <laughs> well, for, you just didn't understand at the time, and also you I, were playing a my... high schooler, so you were like, yeah. I don't know what this means. Like you're just like, <laughs> I, yes. I guess I'm just a guy. <laughs> <laughs> I, I literally played made made my character me. It's literally just me. Yeah, yeah. And then my name D D Dean K. Dean K was just Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong. Yeah, and that's the that's the whole thing. <laughs> But oh it, my it, God. Zach said he would go with me to like make our little characters. I was like, yes. Oh, the dude, figs. painting the mini figs is so fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, yeah, dude. he said he'd do that with me. I'm excited. Yeah, I just yeah. have to come up with my your character. My I'll have to have DJ send you either in group chat or whatever like that. Uh, all the different commissions you've had of like oh, your yeah. campaigns, characters of everybody said they make up, and then he gets them like professionally commissioned by different artists, either oh. on Fiverr or IRL. Like the Eldritch Journey is the big banner that you held up earlier. Oh, yeah, I actually have uh, right here. Jens did it for me. He was, he was Jens was on earlier on Yu-Gi-Oh, right? Yeah. Okay, but you can, here, I'll switch to you again. He did, each of those is like very detailed little cityscapes sort of thing, like different parts of the campaign and... It, they're all references to so many different things and it. Jen's literally listened to every episode. Oh, wow. and yeah. some amazing bull, like I almost bullshit. said bullshit, but it's like, this is probably... <laughs> cool. When he sent me this, I cried. I, like, I, was I remember when you sent me it, you like, zoom in. I'm like, zoom in. I'm enhance. zooming in, my man. <laughs> also, when you were showing me the Puzzle Valley full spread trailer, and I was like, wait, can you zoom in on the rat real quick? <laughs> <laughs> zoom in on the rat. <laughs> so there was a big spread of all the characters. Uh, I think Nick did it, right? Yeah, Nick. Nick. Okay, so yep. Nick did this big of all the characters from Puzzle Valley to like announce like the finals coming out or whatever. Yes, and yeah. there's a there's a there's a rat in there, and I'm like, wait. When he showed me through Discord, I'm like, could you zoom in on the rat real quick? A little lower, and then the rat just has like a pink foot like this on camera, and I'm like, yeah! Screenshot. <laughs> I screenshot it because it was like the only foot. It was funny. It was a rat. Wait, my, my, my favorite part about that was there's a goth girl named Jackie Blue in the camp, and yeah. the second you saw it, you're like, who's that baddie behind me, though? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was like, who's the goth baddie behind me, though? And you're like, that's uh, Jackie Blue. That's Jackie Blue. It's uh, <laughs> one of the coolest characters I ever. Like I can't, like <laughs> Nate has lived it, but he also yeah. hasn't like listened to it. I haven't got to, but I actively tell you that I want to, and I'm I not know. just like saying that to like get you to shut up. I genuinely want to watch it. Just we out here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I don't mean that. Like yeah, yeah. I meant like yeah, yeah. yeah. I get it. Uh, I have it here on my phone. But yes. I, on, you can I, try to. Yeah, that's kind of focusing. You get not. the gist of it. You can see it though. I'll just, I'll just zoom. Oh, well, that's a lot of people. Yeah, like, that's so crazy. <laughs> What's actually funny about that is, like, because but. Nate made his character him, he also made his best friend character. <laughs> Based off of uh, Joe and then my other friend, Chris, who started replays with me. So his name was literally Chris Joe because my brain would not let me be creative for most of this shit. But to him, it was really like, dude, this is awesome. And I'm like, here's the really low effort story behind that. And you're like. Damn, <laughs> I and like bonkies and shit. Bonkies too. is fun, but the thing with Chris, Chris Joe became a, a very big character towards yeah. the end of it. And uh, there's a big moment that I can't wait for you to listen to with Chris Joe that I I am very excited for you to to mm -hmm. hear. I don't know if you had any final things to say, Kayla. Then after that, we'll we'll say our goodbyes to everybody and then hang up with you and then end the stream. Yeah, no, just. It's crazy you guys did this for eight hours. <laughs> yeah, this is our first, like, like, I've live streamed before playing games, but it's like two hours. This is our first live stream, so this, this is crazy first. With first. all of these yeah. different the, guests. Ev yeah. Everything went pretty perfectly, except for Yu-Gi-Oh! wouldn't sign in, and Zoom could not get any audio from the two calls we had. Yeah, we'll Ooh. figure that out. So we had a Facebook call them. like a, a learning thing. Like, now yeah. you kind of know how it works, so. Yeah, exactly. Definitely know a lot more, for sure. Like, I knew a lot of the settings and everything, yeah. but. 24-hour stream win. When we get when we get something to do <laughs> well we went we rent out like one of those trampoline places and just have like a bunch of shit to go on yeah that's probably the with the, like remote streaming with like not illinois valley fucking hell wi-fi i can't i can't <laughs> joe that's a I, know long time. You, 
I know you yeah. Joe brick wall. Well, people on 24 hour streams do sleep sometimes. Like Ludwig will do like a stream. Like he started Zelda the other day when it came out and didn't stop the stream until he beat it. He would like sleep for a few hours off screen with like TTS up or like random video meme compilations and shit. And well, I think like, we'd have to take turns. But, oh yeah, for yeah. sure. To finally finish this off, <laughs> thank you to every guest who we've had on. Thank you to Kayla. Thank you for Shannon. Thank you to Puddle Noir, Tim Bat, uh, Lara Helene. And thank you to Jay Sher. Uh, I know Micah had to leave and, and go to work and whatnot. But, like, thank you so much to everybody who came on and wanted to talk to us about the stuff that they were making, like Walter and uh, Grimm especially. Yeah, uh, there was, and the things where some people joined and, and, like, one reason or another, they were nervous about being on call with us more than anything. And they're, like, stand-up comedians that perform at real shows and shit and, like, all this other stuff. And, like, oh, I was honestly more nervous about joining the call with you guys today than anything. And it's like, really? Us? Yeah. Like, we're nervous too. Like we b are barely running this shit here. We got it. <laughs> well, this whole stream, this whole project is literally about showing the hard work that small content creators mm -hmm. do to make big noise. And the only way that we're going to do anything is by holding up each other and supporting each other. And I am so glad everyone showed up to support all of us. Yeah. I oh, we got to check the money. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll we'll check that up. But I want you guys to know uh, everybody who's helping, like Puddle Noir and uh, Grim and Worm. Shout out to Worm. I know he couldn't be out here. Because yeah, he, had... he has his own whole ass fest going on. Yeah, right now, which is like uh, damn. Everybody who's helping with the whole project, thank you so much. And I haven't written out this script, but I've done the outline of what the script is. Mm -hmm. And I am so excited to show you guys. It's at 310. Holy shit! Damn. So when we checked like three hours in, it was at $143. We are officially, as of the stream, we'll say the end of the stream, it's at $310, which is... About three hundred and five dollars more than I expected. As I said, I expected it to be my dad at like eight fifty nine. Like, good night, buddy. Good stream, and that is genuine. Yeah. Uh, but I wanted to run through and just say thanks to everybody, so that one person didn't feel left out. Just since yeah. we have it here, thank you to Ethan slash Grim, Walter of Channel Awesome, Robert Hines, comedian. Uh, I don't remember how to say her name, so please say her name. Lara right. Lane. L L Lara. Lara. I, I mean, I could be fucking it up, too, so we could... Sorry, if so, uh, Timmy Blaze, of course, thank you, and also thanks to Adele. Jay Sher and Micah, even though Micah couldn't be there, yep. I'm going to thank you anyway, because you're a part of it, and you would be here, and you wanted to. Eldrick Journey, shout out to BJ, Eddie, and Jens. Uh, Jens. Yep. Very fun playing Yu-Gi-Oh, or at least watching it. DJ did get stomped. It's just what it is. Yeah, we know. will have to have a rematch, is all. I, I know. Uh, thank you to Puddle Noir. I... I look forward to looking at everybody else's music and shows that are in this too. By Puddle the way. Noir is so fucking. I love good. I love shoegaze because, like I said, I love like DBC Dust Bowl yep. Champion. His stuff is so awesome, and I found him through TikTok ads. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. last couple names we got Kevin. Thank you. You're very cool to talk to. It was cool. We went to school with you uh, yeah. at college, at least like my freshman year, at least. Yeah. We had, we, class we had together. classes together. It was a great time. Mm -hmm. He's making a lot of... Everyone's making a lot of great shit, and yeah. that's what I love to, like, show And everybody. not that it's good that it's not getting views, but all of it is, like, very low view count and stuff, too, which is, like, we're the... A lot of us are in the same boat of making really cool professional amateur, air quotes on amateur shit, and just... It just exists out there. There's yeah, so we much We have to help each other. We have to, like, Yeah, that's what the community should be about it anyway. It shouldn't be about jealousy and shit. It should just be about, like, oh, you made this really cool thing? I love that for you. Let me yeah. show, show that. Instead of being like I hate that you made that. I exactly. want to make something bigger than you. I'm it's, not going to share it. Fuck you. And it's, like, it's not a competition. We're here. We're out here. We're supporting each other. But thank you to Tim Bath from Worst Idea of All Time uh, for uh, gracing me with uh, that interview that we did. He was uh, one of my. I've been following him for a long time. Thank him so much. And again, since that was the last video interview on there, uh, the video interviews are on DJ's channel, which I think it probably make them public after gonna, this yeah, I'm they're, they are longer tomorrow. than the ones we played on stream because we cut them for time yeah if it's like i said if it was 20 minutes it was on stream and then it was 30 or 40 yeah. on his channel so you have that to look forward to uh, especially like some of these people like channel awesome there's like lore and people that love that and you might have yeah. some exclusive shit in there that no one's seen before like kevin kevin said that one thing about the city in his thing where yeah, he yeah, never yeah. said that before and he said it here exactly like, so that's very cool <clears throat> the fact that larry lane uh the country music is not a country artist anymore she's changing her yeah. sound completely yeah. is uh, a big thing i don't know if you heard that uh, earlier today kayla what was what is her genre uh she's a queer banjo artist with country yeah flair. queer banjo pop artist with country flair and, and she's changing her sound completely because of just oh, the wow. ramp the rampant homophobia in, and it was yeah with the homophobia music. stuff she got doxxed by ben shapiro which oh, wow. is yeah which is wild yeah. so we we went not went off on him but we definitely 
clowned on the little guy. The little guy. Uh, but, uh, well, then we'll say yeah. last thank you to Shannon. Yeah, uh, thank you so much. Shannon's my cousin and a great artist them, uh, themselves. They are a musician and they do a lot of graphic design work. Uh, they're just a great person and I'm so thankful that I finally got to uh, reach out and have anything to do with them. So it, it yeah, was really that was fun really cool. to do. I think we've either way from people like in the stream watching people on the stream and us ourselves have made some very cool connections that I hope to work yeah. further with in the future. Like even like this weird collab too with like Jay Search. It was like let's get Kayla on. Yeah, yeah, it's <laughs> like, so, that's so great. cool. And again, thank you to Kayla too for uh, coming in here playing Phasmophobia yeah. and just enjoying everything. I please like uh, send your or you send me the teaser for the the Minecraft. Yeah, stuff. I'll send you episode one and two. Yeah. And oh shit, yeah, for yeah. Sure. yeah. I should be posting the third one soon. I need awesome. to get on top of posting them regularly, so I, I will try harder. But <laughs> they no, will it's okay. Out. Just don't don't trust yourself out with it. As long well, as you're having fun and you can do it, don't push yourself I mean, too hard because sometimes it just makes it not as fun. Well, I know I've told you that all the time. The I puzzle that guy. point. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You're like, nah, I'm just going to lay in bed and play yeah. a game tonight or watch a movie. Well, and the Puzzle yeah. Valley part of this arc. <laughs> Bruh, I know I gotta edit that still, too. Yeah. There's so much shit. Yes, to show you, you do. I'm going to send you the list and... <laughs> no, <laughs> no, <laughs> you know, I'll show Where's you. Where's the I, art video? <laughs> I could, dude. All right, hold up. <laughs> Let me just throw <laughs> my fucking thing over here real quick. We're gonna not go to the cancel tome, <laughs> which is literally what I dubbed it. All right, we'll throw this one up first. Just this is 2022 shit that's left to do. Each line is a video. Uh, not all of them are super long. That's the done ones. Okay, so that's 2022. Most of that's Fortnite. There's GFR, Raft, Faz, and like the video files, some of them are like 45 minutes. Some Minecraft random shit. And then my server stuff is hella long. Nate messaged me. Oh my uh, goodness. Uh, yeah, I just record. I'm, if we're going on, I'm like, yeah, let's go. <laughs> yeah. Nate messaged me, Yeah, uh, I think earlier this week, and he was like, listen, uh, I'm going to need like a bit to not think about any of this yeah <laughs> it's because you have so much stuff to catch up on and i so, get that i'm i'm just we're gonna be making props we're gonna be making a here's the 2023 a list yeah to finally just like put a pin in it oh, like yes. this, this whole project season of the curse 2 it's literally a a testament to small content creators and the amount of effort they put into their work even when they know that they don't exactly have a big audience but they do that for themselves because that's what it means to be a, a content creator especially a small one mm -hmm. and i just want to support all of my local content creators no matter how big no matter how small so again thank you guys for tuning in and i just wanted to make it clear that the fundraiser will be going Another Until month. June 15th, for sure, which is a day after my birthday, June 14th. If you're from America, it's Flag Day. There it is. Just keep checking the description of this, everybody, for a link you're looking for. And if we don't post it and somebody is on here that we didn't post, just comment or let us know yeah. directly. We will, we'll make sure that your links are out. We're not trying to screw you guys up. But, yeah, so it's going to go for another month, and you can donate if you want. You don't have to donate if you don't want to. This whole stream has just about been about, like, spreading awareness for the projects of local artists or small Smaller artists. Local, well, small artists far apart. Yeah, exactly. Kind of yeah, yeah. is the thing. It just support people who are trying to put their passions out there because this world is not a. It, even if it's just our fun things, it's very vulnerable putting out the shit that it, we like to do and do out in the here. It and... is in incredibly vulnerable, yeah. and I support anyone who puts any type of effort into it. Mm -hmm. So uh, I guess we're that's us signing off at our nine hour and nine minute mark. Nice. I'll talk to you later, Kayla. Thank you again, and then Hi. everyone else. Thank you for watching. Thanks for joining. Goodbye, I'm a disconnect from call. Disconnect. Bye. Yeah, bye. And okay. uh, again, thank you so much. And I can't wait to tell you more updates in the future about Season of the Curse 2 and everything that was going on. Mm -hmm. I agree. Um, let's just, I'm going to mute the mic, turn it on black, and then let it sit for a minute. Okay. And then just so that we for sure get the end. So okay, it doesn't cool. like kill itself on the export. Uh, again, I'm punking on stop. I almost said this is pun punkin replays because <laughs> a couple thousand times of doing that will make you go insane more than you already are. Yep. But I'm punking on stop. This has been the Arby's Season of the Curse 2 live stream fucking whatever. Uh, <laughs> it's gimmick yeah, slash gimmick. Eldritch Journeys. Eldritch Journeys. My real name is Nate and his real name is DJ. Yep. Uh, just in case that was confusing at any point, I guess. Honestly, I don't yeah. know. We don't know who's watching for sure. Exactly. But uh, uh, thank you everyone. Support again. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And I cannot wait to show you any type of updates on Season of the Curse 2. We'll be getting at you uh, in the future. So. I agree. All right. Uh, thank you. Bless up. Everybody drive safe. Uh, <laughs> have a good weekend. All right.
Uh, Baveth. All right, we're gonna. You fuckers are still here? <laughs> I've always wanted to do this bit like I ended the stream, but it's not done yet. They still got six on there. Alright, I'm actually gonna go now. Puzzle Valley. Puzzle Valley, Punkin' Unstop, Elder Journeys. Season of the Curse 2. Uh, and everybody else's stuff. Puddle Love one. you. Bye.